day, I was watching ESPN again. Now, the owner of the Miami Dolphins line saying that he never did that. He ain't offered uh, Flores no money to lose games and all that shit. But my thing is this. Why don't the police or the FBI or somebody over the NFL or Roger Goodell subpoena his motherfucking cell phone records? See? They think we all stupid. Why don't they subpoena his cell phone records? That's what they would do to us if we we did something. The first thing they want to do, first of all, drug test us, which they should drug test him, subpoena his cell phone records all around that day, all of his damn cell phone records, emails, everything. Because, see, they protect the rich. He been talking to other motherfuckers about the shit. He ain't the only one. It's other owners. They said, you Jackson, when he was in Cleveland, subpoena the owner of the Cleveland Browns records and emails during that time. Shit, uh, Daz Bryant just said, while he was on the Cowboys, they kept running the same plays and they didn't use him and he got frustrated like some shit was going on. He just said that Dad's Bryant for the Cowboys. So it's a bunch of this motherfucking shit going on. It fucks with the integrity of the NFL. And if they gonna do that, it make motherfuckers not even want to watch it. So they need to clean up everything. Get it back on track. Give a couple of teams to some black owners. And quit bullshitting. You know, all that line. Cell phone records, emails. That's it right there. This Mr. Monkey. And this shit ain't even funny at all this time. Fuck that shit. Normally I be laughing and bullshitting, but I'm mad. Because it, it fucks over the careers of black people doing this shit. I'm out.